so we are supposed to get snow tomorrow despite the fact that it's 56 degrees right now um, so I get the truck ready I'm supposed to get like uh, um, I've heard 6 to 10 I've heard 10 to 14 and then I've also heard 1 to 2 feet so uh, hopefully it's not 1 to 2 feet that big storms they suck um, <clears throat> and it's supposed to be a wet heavy snow so that's going to make it even worse uh, so I got a phone holder for my truck I got to look for the blue teeth bluetooth and because uh, that's a pain in the ass once we get this much snow there's going to be customers and people calling you know all hours all the time and with this being a manual trans it's just a pain in the ass to, to have to stop what I'm doing just to talk on the phone so I got to clean out the salt bags and then uh, straighten up the inside and get it ready to go all right, so I think we're good to go. Check the oil. Uh, the antifreeze is good. So I mounted the little car mount for the phone. I'll show you that in a minute. Got the GoPro stuff up there instead of it flopping around the seat. And uh, the little book for the snow clown is under here, the binder to keep track of everything. And uh, yeah, so this is the little mount I got. I think it's made by like Belkin or Sashi, something like that. Like nine bucks. A little suction cup. Good enough for what I'm using. Uh, I guess if you were using GPS, you can twist it. Um, and then I ended up taking the vent clips that it comes with and just running the wire up like that. I always had the defrosters on when it's snowing, so keep the wipers nice and clean. Ran across and just used the other one. Uh, I couldn't tell you how many charges I've ruined or you unplug it they go dead down on the floor and as you can see salt and water and everything else you gotta plug it in your phone the next time it's all corroded and shot so that would be nice and I can't find the Bluetooth so I'll have to run the Best Buy tonight and pick one up I got everything in the back situated I usually run two shovels uh, in case one breaks or in case we both have to shovel uh, usually my brother is with me so as I'm doing a driveway he's doing the sidewalks a uh, little bucket and then uh, I stick those shovels right up in the sideboard in the body and believe it or not they stay there so it's nice you hop out and you can reach right from by the door and grab them and go you don't have to climb up here like 10 bags of salt the blower which I don't think we're going to need that I think it's supposed to be heavy snow and then the gas cans on the other side so We should be good to go. Hopefully we'll put this baby to use too. These people are getting smart. They're watching the weather so they know if it gets warm the next day they're starting to tell me, oh, don't worry about salt. So, all right. Hopefully I see you guys next time when it's dark out.